Walk down the street, everybody I meet, nobody takes me seriously. All right, now we've got a thong solo. Oh no, that's got drumming. That's the thong solo. I can speed it up. Whoa! All right, now we've got the Jester Bell. He's faster than the thong solo. Talk about life. Can I offer you this? You know what I'm going to talk about? Something that's been bothering me for a few days. And that is some fuckwit in a call centre that's been sending me messages saying that he's from the Australian Tax Department and I have a tax bill. Right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to ring the fucker right now. Right. By the way, if you're calling in Australia, I'll give you his number. He's a real arsehole, this bloke. Yeah, it's in Australia, the number is 02-6190-0598. And you'll get some turkey there, reckons you've got a tax bill. He might want you to buy some bloody cards and scratch the back of them. Stupid fool. Well, I'm gonna give him a call now. I'm just gonna turn off my call identifier. And I'm going to call the bastard and see how he is today. Because I'm sick of him, but one thing I have is plenty of fucking time. Right? Let's have a look now. Show my caller ID. Yep, well, I've just turned that off. All right, now we're on. Okay. This will be fun. Put it on loudspeaker. Let's hope he answers. Oh, you see, they just won't pick up my call anymore. I think they're sick of me. You know, it's terrible. You know, when you turn it around and turn it on them and they run scared, it gives me nothing to fucking do. So that number in Australia is 02619000598. Tell them Sidecar Farrell sent you. Right on. That's that prick done with for now. Why does no one take me seriously? I can't do it out anymore. I mean, if I had a drinking problem, I could understand that. If I, you know, was somewhat disfigured, or, or, or if I stunk of bat crap, but why or how would that ever happen around here? Mm. But the main thing is, I'm gonna to get to the bottom of this and the, the the question on my mind is why don't people take me seriously? Who wrote that song? Don't take me seriously anymore. Who wrote that song? They don't take me seriously anymore. Maybe I did. Did I write that song? Okay, here's the first verse. Sometimes I need a stranger. Sometimes I need a friend. Sometimes I lend a hand. Sometimes but doesn't matter what I do, nobody takes me seriously anymore. Nobody takes me seriously anymore. Doesn't matter whether I'm on the bus or in the bank or down at the park playing with the pool, play, playing with something, nobody takes me seriously anymore. Why? Why? That's the chorus. Just two words. Why? Why? Next verse. Verse number two will come up in a minute. Wait for it. It's worth waiting for. Starts off fairly generic line, of course. Nobody takes me seriously anymore. Nobody takes me seriously anymore. Could be a pretty girl about to go through the door. She laughs. Nobody takes me seriously anymore. Second chorus. Why, why? John, do you like it? Nobody takes me seriously. No, I'm changing the whole song. I've decided I'm going to change that song. I need a new a kind of a beat. Hear those bells? Right. You've got those bells going, right? You can hear that? I need some percussion. Oh yeah, I've got the drum. Bells and drum. Bells and drum. Bells and drum. Bells and drum. 
Nobody takes me seriously. Nobody takes me seriously. Chorus. Why me? Why me? Second verse. Nobody takes me seriously. Nobody takes me seriously. I wish I had a pen right now. Big, thick marking pen. I don't care whether it's black or red or blue. And I don't care whether it's whiteboard suitable. All I want is a big fucking black marker pen. Or blue or purple or red. So I can write something on the middle of my stomach. Charcoal. I could go old school. Charcoal. I could burn some timber. Light it up. Then I've got black on the end. And that's all right too. And I could do something on my chest. I could do a V for Volmeister. I could do a V for Volmeister. Let's see. Let's see. What do we got now? Um, nobody takes me seriously. Nobody takes me seriously. Nobody takes me seriously anymore. You sure that's not a song? You sure? Maybe I made it up. Okay, so. See if I've got a big, thick marker pen in my bag. You know why? I want a marker pen. You know, sometimes I carry a marker pen. Well, not today, obviously. What a bad fucking day. There's no marker pen. Oh. You don't have a marker pen, right? You've got a little bit of bells. You've got some percussion. Right, and then, where would be, where would we be without, and hang on, nobody takes me seriously, nobody takes me seriously, I can't figure that out, why me, why me, that's the, that, that's the chorus, hang on, keep the drumming going, Max, alright, hang on, hang on, hang on, We're speeding the song up, speeding the song up, nobody takes me seriously, Nobody takes me seriously. Why me? Why me? Nobody takes me seriously. Now, are you ready? A one, two, three for the big Australian addition to the ensemble. We've got the black thong. Right on, man. Nobody takes me seriously. Nobody takes me seriously. Nobody takes me seriously. Nobody takes me seriously. Why me? Why me? Why me? Uh, nobody takes me seriously. Here's an ad for uh, uh, a store where I bought these. Doesn't matter the store, I can't think of the name, but they were $1.50 Australian, folks. That's why when you play the song, you want a song that's got bend. You don't need some expensive fucking thong. You need a thong that has bend, right? Bend. Holy shit. I can hear people. I can hear people. It's gone. I'm freaking out again. It's gone. Nobody takes me seriously. Nobody takes me seriously. Why me? Why me? for the rice farmer hat. Rice farmer hat, rice farmer hat. Anybody know any rice farmers? You know any rice farmers? Nope. Well, I do, I know one. And his name is Slim Fielding. I'm Slim Fielding, rice farmer from hay. Not hay farmer from rice, rice farmer from hay, Slim Fielding. I've got my own low-lying paddocks. Who's lying about what? 
Oh, well, maybe it's a little lie. Maybe I don't have any paddocks. Maybe I am not slim fielder, slim fielding the rice grower from home. in Australia, two shots, I took out this wild table. 